Hey, Bob, this is Squidly. Hey, man, I got a secret trail for you, but you can't tell anyone. Don't tell a soul. Hey, I have a map. It's a secret trail, but it's really dangerous. I'm going to give you the details in a letter, okay? I'm going to send you a letter with those details and a trail map. All right, listen, don't Google it. If you Google it, the government's going to know that you're researching it and you're going to hike it. The letter's going to have all the details for the resupply places and some people that you're going to meet along the way. It's called the Middle Earth Trail. <laughs> Only you, Bob, have the skill set to hike this trail. You on there? Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Bob. I'm back. I wanted to talk to you about something. I just got something in the mail. First class mail, so you know it's important. Got this from uh, Gone Farrell with Squidly. He's one of my hiking buddies. He sent me this and said it's top secret. Can't tell nobody about it, so... I thought I'd share it with you, but I, I would ask you to keep it on the down low. Keep it on the hush-hush. Let's talk about it. I got a map to a secret trail. I'm going to put it up here and show it to you. But again, don't tell anybody about this, all right? All right, let's get started. Wow. This is incredible. It's a secret map. Sent to me for a gone feral with Squidly. This is amazing. So Squidly knows about this uh, secret trail right here. He sent me a map, <clears throat> and he also sent me a letter. The letter details where I've got to go. He also tells me a lot of details about the map and where I can get resupplies and people I can meet and different things about the trail. Now, nobody's supposed to know about this place. Only Squidly and I know about this trail. The trail is called the Middle Earth Trail. He told me. He said, now, Bob, don't Google this or anything because the government, they'll be watching. They want to know where you're going, and they don't want you to see this trail. It's a magical place, and this Middle Earth trail has not been seen by the human eye. But it's going to be seen by Bob because, you see, Gone Farrell was squidly. He knew, and he said it in the letter. I have a special skill set, sort of like Liam Neeson in the movie Taken. I have special skills that allows me to hike this trail. He's seen me hike, and he knows that I fought Sasquatch in a battle royal. Didn't win, but it was kind of a tie. Well, he kind of beat me. Whatever. Now, I can't tell you where the trail is, because that's just between me and Squid. But I want to be first to go on the trail. So I'm going to tell you some of the places I'm going to see and who I'll find out on the trail. But I can't tell you where it is or what state it's in, or anything like that. But let me tell you a little bit about the trail. All right, so we're going to first start out here in the Shire. Now, Squidly says there's a bunch of people that live in the Shire that's kind of little people. They're really smart, and they're really inquisitive, and they kind of hoard stuff. I, I, I don't know why they hoard things in their house, but anyway, that's beside the point. They're going to take me to the town of Bree. This little town, it's a resupply town. So once we get there, we will uh, resupply. And I'm supposed to beat this old guy, and he's got a beard longer than mine. And he's going to show me this other guy who can help me along the trail. From there, we'll take the Great East Road. Even go to this place with these people with pointy ears. That sounds weird. But anyway, we're supposed to meet them, and that's a resupply on the trail too. Now, I may be gone for a year or so, so you people out there that love Backpacker Bob, you won't see me on Crow's channel. I kind of sneak in here and get his mail sometimes and help him out with his house, but you won't see me anymore. For about a year, I'll be on this trail. And then we're going to head down here to Rohan. Now, Rohan's got some people that may help me. It's a good resupply town, but this may take six months. You see these mountains here? There's some tough mountains, but I've got a special skill set. So I can handle those mountains. Even some snow and some passes and things that normal people can't make. From there, we'll head down here to this place called Gondor. Now, I don't know much about it, but Squid says it's a rough place. But he did tell me one thing. Squid says, don't cross these mountains over here to this place called Mordor. 
Never heard of this place. But he said don't Google it. So I won't. I don't want the government finding out that I'll be the first on this trail. But anyway, in Mordor, they said those people don't like hiker trash over there. Nope. They don't like them. You know what he says? He says they'll give you the stink eye. They'll squint their eye and look at you kind of funny. So I don't want to resupply over there and said it's some nasty food. Don't want me going over there. But anyway, I'll avoid that and head over here to this place called the Sea of Ruin. That's where I'll get a ride back home. Now, like I said, Bob may be gone for a year or more. It's the longest trail in history. It's an ancient trail that not many people know about through time. But Squid knows about it. And he sent me this map. And he sent me this letter with details on how to find the trailhead that leads me to the Shire. I got all my supplies and I got my backpack all ready. I even borrowed some food from uh, Crow. It was in his refrigerator. I don't think he wants it. Or if I don't make it back, remember, remember out there, Bob loves you. And I appreciate you watching me as I've gone hiking and stuff. Thank you, Squid, for sending me this map and this letter with all the details. Oh, I can't wait to get out on the Middle Earth Trail. Woohoo! You know, I think it was Mother Teresa that said, you gotta follow your dreams because you gotta go for the gusto. I think that was Mother Teresa. I think she also said, if you ain't first, you're last. And that's why I'm going to be first on the Middle Earth Trail. I'm going to complete it. A complete through hike. I don't know if she said that or not. But anyway, it doesn't make a difference. But she also said this. She said, the children are our future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. Well, that ain't got nothing to do with this. But that's what she said. See you guys in a year or so. Maybe. If I make it. I've read this letter about 45 times from Squid. And he told me i got to keep it a secret. So what I'm about to do is, I'm about to eat it. Because I don't want anybody to get the details. Can't be thrown in the garbage. Got to eat it. All right. The details are now in my head. Yep, like a safe. Like an elephant. I remember everything. Oh my goodness. Look at this guy. What the heck? Who's hitchhiking up here in the middle of nowhere, man? That's nothing up here but skinwalkers and blind frogs. What the heck? What are you doing? Hey, how's it going over there? Well, you know, we're trying to figure out why you're out here. Well, a friend of mine, he told me that I should be looking for the Middle Earth Trail. Oh. So, I've been hiking for the last three months from Alabama. This is Utah, right? Yeah. He told me this is where I'd find it. It's the Middle Earth Trail. Oh, I, I, hop on in. I'll give you a ride. We'll, we'll get you hooked up with the right people. Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You got a Coke Zero? Uh, yeah, I love a Coke Zero. No, no, you got one for me. No, I ain't got no Coke Zero. <sighs> All right, I'll give you a ride anyway. Come I on. I haven't eaten in the like, last six days. All right. Well, I think I can get you like a pretzel or something. Yeah, I'm really hungry. All right, come on in. Trip. Let's do it. Do you know where the Middle Earth Trail is? Oh, yeah, yeah. We're going to have to turn around because this is not the right way. But we'll get you there. Well, he told me it was right here somewhere. Well, somewhere's right, but it ain't that somewhere. Do you know Squidly from Gold Feral and Squidly? Is it Squidly? Yeah. No. He's got a YouTube channel. Oh. I need to check that out. Now you look familiar. Do you have a YouTube channel? Yeah, I got packs a lot. Packs a lot. It looks like you're packing a lot too. I got a bunch of stuff, but I ain't got no food. I sure would appreciate a ride if you could take me to a place where I could find some food in a hotel. Yep, we got just the place for you, buddy. Oh, I appreciate it. Come on in. Thank you so we much. We got people in the road gonna run you over. Okay, thanks. <laughs> How you doing there? Yeah, good to meet y'all. I'm Backpacker Bob. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. All right, Bob, this is about as far as I can take you here. It's been an interesting journey with you, learning about your Middle Earth trail you're looking to find. But we got you here to this Skinwalker Ranch. If you just nose around here and you find a guy named Dragon, he'll be able to hook you up. Skinwalker Ranch. It's a hotel, right? Yeah, oh well, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, all right, well thanks so much. Yep, I, no I tell you what, I'm gonna get that squiddly when I get back to the uh -huh. Middle Earth Trail. 
What was I thinking? I should have Googled it, right? Yeah, yeah, that could have uh, helped. Lord of the Rings, that's some sort of movie, right? Yeah, you might find out of the Earth Trail here. You never know. Well, I appreciate you <laughs> taking me this far, buddy. God, thanks so much. I mean, this place looks like it's uh, legit. Legit, yeah. yeah, legit hotel. Oh yeah, it looks great. All right, yeah. I'll, I'll see you later then. Appreciate right. your help. Good luck. All right, I'm out here at the Skinwalker Ranch. Uh, Pax dropped me off here and said it's gonna be a nice place to hang out. So uh, appreciate you, Pax, dropping me off. Thanks, appreciate it, Pax. All right, right on. Best of luck, buddy. Oh, thanks, man. I'll tell you that, Squidly. I'm gonna get you, Squidly. Told me about the Middle Earth Trail. Ain't no Middle Earth Trail. Give me that stinking map. I'm gonna get you, Squidly. Yeah. All right, best of luck to you. Appreciate the patch. You're sucking earth, man. Appreciate it.